Oh, 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 ladies and gentlemen, we got Ellie, a new hairstyle. But first, the hell is this sound? Is it the toaster? Is it the machine? Ellie, Ellie, she has a new hairstyle. Let's talk to her then. What a mess. Something on your mind? Did we make a mess, Ellie? Look at that. That fits her so perfectly. She actually looks like a... Well, not a pirate anymore. Like a nice lady who has been raised up by fancy rich parents. Which, of course, she did not get raised by them. I think... No. Oh, tell me more, bud, yeah. I'm a surgeon by training and a pirate by inclination. Not much else to know, Captain. I like long walks on the promenade and the smell of Spacer's Corona. I make a mean zero-G cocktail and I've got a meaner right hook. Um, what's a zero-G cocktail? It's a mix of whatever you've got on hand. Usually zero-G brew with some Spectrum vodka if you're lucky. Purple berry shake if you're not. Ah, uh, sorry I didn't listen. I was thinking about a cocktail joke. <laughs> let's, let's ignore it. Inventive. That sounds disgusting. Out on the edge of the Aether, we learn to make do with what we've got. No room for fancy predilections. Uh, do you have much experience contracting out with other captains? Sure do. Some of it was even legal. Oh. Hmm. You weren't joking about being a pirate. What gave it away? It's the hair, right? <laughs> or maybe the ammo belt? I had it custom made. Hmm. No, it, it's definitely the hair. Ah, uh, you casual outlook on legality. You casual outlook on legality. Why does that not feel right in my mouth? Wait, you want to look like a pirate? Gotta advertise your business somehow. I've done all types of work with all kinds of crews. If there's one thing you ought to know about me, it's that I won't tell you your business. Your ship, your way. Oh, I should have given you a mohawk. Oh. That sounds reasonable. It's worked for me this long. I was hoping to know something more personal about you. Well, my blood type is AB positive. I'm a Leo, and I despise Space Hospital. Never mind what anyone else tries to tell you. That about covers it. Leo, huh? Where are you from? How did you get in this line of work? Come on, that stuff's boring. You're deflecting. Look, the thing I've learned about living in close quarters is that you've got to give people room to breathe. I'm all for making a few bits together and having fun doing it, but let's keep a little professional distance. Girl, we don't... No complaints here. ...have doors here. Oh, they actually do work. Well, lucky you. <laughs> we do have... That's a nice leather jacket. It's this dressed bullet riddled leather jacket. Well, of course, mine, which is all red and kind of destroyed already. Oh, do I have to show you my leather jacket now? God damn it, I've already brought it up. <laughs> Give me a second. This one is so broken that it's just throwing stuff everywhere. Mm. You probably can't even see it in the dark. But it's... Can you see it? I probably need a bright screen. Let's open Google. Then you get a bright screen. Um, that's, gonna, that's a detour that I don't need to go into, but... Let's just look up the brightest thing I can find. So, there, there's a jacket. It's cool, it's very apocalyptic because it's broken. That makes it cool and apocalyptic. Okay, I'm gonna put it off in a second. I just need to find a way off my ship. Damn it, <laughs> I find a way to navigate this game. Okay, companions can still die. So I need to be careful to not 
get them into too much danger eat it drink it think about it let it sink it yeah, this doesn't make sense and i probably should upgrade the armor let's see who's wearing that no name no name that's early 18 26 19 damn i could just upgrade that mm, now let's just not get into too much trouble we are on the ground breaker we should go not to mona there we are now in orbit above byzantium captain a word captain oh yeah since we're in byzantium there's something i've been meaning to do what's that i haven't actually talked to my folks in a while shocking right anyway it's probably about time i paid them a visit given the dangerous life i lead they've got to be worried sick that's the perfect side mission actually yes let's do that Look, of course, let me just help you. Whoa, let's calm down. I'm not asking for a favor or anything. I'm just suggesting we stop by when we're in the neighborhood. See, I'm originally from Byzantium, born and raised. I know that probably comes as a big surprise. Yeah, I've only played this game like two times already. Actually, I can see it. It's your hairstyle. But I worked so hard. I dropped the accent, picked up a swagger, developed a taste for spacer's choice. It's it's the the it's not the best choice. No, God damn it, I forget it. It's no, that's the problem. You try a little too hard. Hmm. Well, I bet they won't know the difference. I bet they'll barely recognize me. Absolutely not. Oh, okay, no. Oh, I don't see why can't go see them when it's convenient. Oh, well, I was thinking you'd come too. <laughs> okay, we'll go. Great. And when we get there, draw out your rough edges a bit. If you've got an outfit you haven't washed in a while, maybe one with some blood stains, wear that one. I never wash my outfits. Did you see my leather jacket? What? Oh, and help yourself to the good snacks and put your feet on the coffee table. Mother hates that. Oh, I'm gonna be super nice. It's almost like you want me on my worst behavior. That's the idea. Anything else? Oh, I'm gonna be super nice. Super nice. I kind of like that outfit. The best basic default outfit out of the punch. Damn it! Oh. Oh. I have the wrong game in mind with buttons. <laughs> okay, Take sure. To watch your back. Yes, boss. No, no. Calm down, Vicar. It's not you. Read your book again. Yeah, yeah, you too, man. <laughs> you too. We're gonna take the girly team. Girly Ellie. And Commander Pavati, as I call her. The second in charge. But die, Commander Pavati is taking over the ship. Oh, wah! Ha! I never saw this game by night. That's something they made new. Ha! That's cool. That's cool, man. That's part of the weather effects, I guess. Music is nice too. It just takes too long till I pull it up. No. Oh. Okay, guess I won't pull it up anymore. God, I probably already deleted my screenshot I took of that. Maybe I have it still. For comparison sakes for my tumblr well, i post screenshots and thumbnails mostly and fitness videos here and there oh, i forgot to lower my fps i'll give it a limit 
Bye, team. Where's Mrs. Adulande? At least eyes are the only ones that are not super creepy and uh, looking watery and fishy. See it. And I talk to your boss. How may I be of assistance? There's still a job I need to do for her. But I don't know where the quest marker is. Uh, maybe. Oh, goddamn button configurations. Maybe uh, I still look a little bit glitched. Screenshot. And accidentally shot her. Um, just looking at my companions. Super close up. That's a long journey. I forgot, is there a fast travel function? <laughs> Probably not in Supernova. Probably not in Supernova anyways. I'm screwed there. Finest cigarettes in Halcyon. Wentzworth cigarettes. Eh. I'm not a smoker. Ho! Oh! Yeah, that's cool. They did a good job with that. Can't I go in here? No. They definitely did a good job with that. Where does that actually lead me to? The sewers? Oh yeah, that's bad. I don't... Sewers are dangerous. And it's... Daytime. What a transition. Oh god. Did you hear? Marjorie Dalton and Archibald Harris are yeah. decorated with real... Yeah. There's my parents' place. Smell that? Industrial grade cleaning solvent and desperation. I brought the nicest person with me, Ellie. Parvati. Let's go in there and talk because that's the only thing I wanna do right now. So nobody dies. Still though. God the buttons. Okay. Proud of me, Ellie? That's what you wanted, right? Oh, that's also good stuff. Mystic gel. Mm. Okay, let's say hello. Marilyn, is that you? Mars, we certainly didn't expect to see you like this. And I didn't expect you to renew your marriage contract. But we're all full of surprises today, aren't we? Speaking of surprises, you should meet my new friend. We've been running around the system for a while now, stirring up all sorts of trouble. It's been a little bit more than one day. Oh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you for the welcoming, for welcoming us into your home. I don't know what to say. He's usually not like this. Come on, you're supposed to help me make an impression. Anyway, you're probably wondering where I've been all this time. Not <clears throat> exactly. The last few years have been a bloody haze. You wouldn't believe the messes we've gotten ourselves into. Right? Uh... Indeed, we saved towns and restored properties across Halcyon. Are you trying to make me look bad? Marilyn, this really isn't the best time. Uh, perhaps you should go. Uh, 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 this is getting awkward. That means it's getting fun. We'll stay as long as we like. And while we're at it, we'll drink your expensive hooch, wear our outside shoes all over your nice floors. Ah, uh, perception holds up. These floors aren't just nice, they're top quality marble. He's right. Since when can you afford authentic Terran marble? That's what we've been trying to tell you, dear, but you must understand, we hadn't heard from you in ages. We thought you were dead. 
I'm not dead. I just never wanted to talk to you again. I'm afraid the distinction was lost on us, darling. Why do I get the feeling you people are about to apologize for something? We only did what any grieving parents in our position would do. We collected on your life insurance policy. And the payouts have been rather uh, substantial. You what? Well, now that I'm here, I guess you'll just have to report back that I'm very much alive and kicking. It's not that simple. For one thing, we'd have to cut back on so many necessities. The neighbors would be sure to notice. Why did you do that? We had to explain your disappearance somehow. We couldn't very well tell people you'd you'd run off to become a a miscreant, could we? Oh, why not? The neighbors would talk, and not in a good way. We concocted a story about Celeste Jolly Girl designing a pair of twelve-inch heels for you. One of a kind, naturally. That led to your tragic death when you tripped and broke your neck. It was quite the story. People were talking about it for weeks. I don't know why, but I have a sudden urge to turn my face come off. Burp, and I'm gone. Story time. Couldn't you have at least made up a better story? Something with pirates or raptodons? And what are you going to do now that we're here? Yes, um, about that. We were just about to ask you to, uh, leave. Quietly, if you don't mind. I'm afraid it would cause quite a stir if the neighbors saw you two stomping about. That's it? You just want us to disappear now? Marilyn, please. Don't cause a scene. Fine. I'm gone. Forever this time. I'm the listening quiet type. Sorry, your ma'am. Ah, uh, Ellie. Let's cool. talk outside. Okay. Is there something else to steal here? I killed them before. It's not a good idea. She gets mad. <sighs> and that might get me killed too. In the outside parts of Pisentium. First look at the sunset. Hey, I did a good job with those weather effects at least. Mm. Oh. That's dangerous. Damn. Oh, there's a gardener here. Uh -huh. Yes, let's talk. Can you believe those two? We'd hardly been there a minute, and they turned us out like yesterday's garbage. Mm, they shouldn't have gotten so upset. No, that's not cool. Oh, you were making quite a scene, girl. But not like I wanted. I had it all planned out. They'd both be sitting there watching one of their vapid Aetherwave dramas, and then we'd walk in. Mother would drop her mock apple cider. And the glass would shatter all over their overpriced marble. Father would tear off his glasses and blink open mouthed. Yeah, shit does never quite work out when we plan it too intensely ahead. It's always done weird. This is a very specific fantasy. Shh, I'm getting to the good part. I'd have a great one liner in the tube. I was thinking either the leather's fake, but the scars are real, or. Oops, did I just track awesome onto your rug? <laughs> Father would throw his hands up because this would be just like me to come back and make a big scene. Then mother would do the old, you had us worried sick. Her eyes would be red and she'd have her fist in front of her mouth to stifle a sob. Oh. 
It should not be better than this. I just didn't want to get booted out of the house I grew up in like that. It's embarrassing, you know. And I've got a reputation to maintain. First time. First time, girl. Seems familiar. That's, <laughs> yeah, that sounds familiar. I hope you don't think I'm talking about this because I want to be introspective. Hmm. Ah. This episode reflects on them, not you. What? But I want to talk about me now. Uh. <laughs> I don't like any of those. Uh. You can learn something from this. It's up to you to determine what that is. Can I just have a drink and punch some poor defenseless pillow instead? A pillow? Anyway, I don't want to sift through this lousy experience for meaningful life lessons. I'm mad and I want to do something about it. Something like... Fuck. Wait a second. What oh. if I could get that money? Oops. Um, keep talking. I could open a new account. Designate that account holder as a sole beneficiary, all the payouts would go to me. I'll make money without doing a thing, and I'll get to cut them off. Oh, quite the one reversed cut. As long as I don't develop a taste for Wolgonzola and bad legal dramas, that's fine by me. My policy is with the Greater Halcyon Insurance Group, they have an office in Byzantium. Maybe you could use some of your people skills to help me set up a dummy beneficiary account. If that doesn't work, I'm sure we can find one of their terminals and do it ourselves. Sure. Give me those free experience points. Uh. Miss Ellie, or er, uh, Dr. Finhill, I notice your pistol's been making a funny noise. What are you talking about? I oil it every night. Well, look here. Your slide's not recoiling fully. You might be due for a new spring. I could take a look. Maybe fix it for you. Uh, sure. I'm short on bits at the moment, but I'll pay you back. Oh, no. I mean, it don't cost nothing. I got a spare spring in my pocket here, even. Everything's got a price. Does the drone have a new skin? Medical drone. It's just not an aggressive one. God, I know there are so many spots that kind of put me in danger, like this one. I think we can both agree that Maverick Johnston is the finest. I don't give a crap about Maverick Johnston and so many loot caches that I can't loot because it's gonna get me killed. What the hell is this? This doesn't seem familiar. Oh, wonder. Why is nobody in this line? Wanda? I'm afraid I can't help you at the moment. Have a prosperous day. Uh, it's not prosperous, Olive. A fine day for parcel pickups, isn't it? Welcome to Halcyon Parcel Service. Deliveries guaranteed within standard margins of accuracy. What? Halcyon Parcel Service is the most dependable parcel delivery service in the colony. You might even say we're part and parcel of Halcyon's commercial enterprise. Mm. That's just a little parcel joke. <laughs> I'm done here. That's all I can handle. Of worst place. Oh boy. Okay. Yep, let's just bring out our big sniper rifle in the middle of the rich people's city. What could go wrong? What's that? Bro, why am I not allowed in there? I'm afraid I can't come down anymore, my good man. I'd have to request a counter waiver, and you know how dreadful I know that voice. Slap your whole family tonight. Okay. There's nothing special in here. There's a stupid quest in here. I always loved that sculpture. That is just the worst quest ever. You with the hips, over here. Let me take a closer look at you. Which one of us? 
Ah, ah, ah. Don't speak. Hold that posture for a moment while I admire you. You have a natural contraposto, my dear. The way you rest your weight against your hip suggests a certain rugged charisma possessed only by the mighty primal and the well-traveled spacer. Splendid. I love it. Mm. What's this about pasta? Oh, you slay me. Not pasta, my dear. Contraposto. To slouch fashionably. One's posture reveals the quality of one's character. Oh, yes. I'm Celeste Jolicoeur, and you, my dear, are exactly what Byzantium needs. Oh. Are you trying to sell me something? I want armor parts. I'm an artist, darling, not a tweed merchant. I don't sell things. I pollinate the world with art. I'm working on a new line of clothing that will shock this city to its core, and I'd like your help. What do you say, my dear? Care to make history with me? No, because this quest sucks. Ah, uh, think about Consider it. Consider it a standing offer. Why? Because you're just standing there, right? Cool. Okay. Do we have something 29? Oh, day. Hey, hey. 29 is pretty good. How expensive? 700? 29? Why? Is that so much more expensive? I don't get it. I mean, I can buy something like that for Ellie. Or I could just upgrade her armor. And sell the stupid armor things I have with me. Felix's armor and Pravati's overall. Oh, 29 is pretty much better than her 18. Termination. B. Damn. I like her armor though. Oh, I could just upgrade it a bit. Hmm. Tech skills 18 and 29. That's a big difference. Psst. Ah. Let's put her. What can I do for no, I'm gonna find. No, <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Session is too difficult. I love Byzantium. Oh, can't make the decision on my model of the system. It's not super accurate. I once treated a lady who got her hand caught in the gears. The idiot was more worried about her rings than her fingers. Where's the bank? I need to Prosperity Plaza. Give me the free XP. That's the gun shop, right? Yes. Do you sell cool armor pieces? Looking for weapons? You've come to the right place. Every Byzantine needs high quality armaments, and you won't find better anywhere else. What do people around here need weapons for? Why? To defend their property, of course. 50 Bit says he's got a hard on right now. Byzantium is the best of what Halcyon has to offer. It's up to us to protect it. Protect it from what? From me? Marauders, dissidents, especially large sprats. One never knows what threat might arise. Ah. Oh, no, I already infiltrated Percentium and slayed it, so it's on the threat. I get it, smart man. One can never be too well armed. Who knows when the hordes may hurl themselves at our gates? Yes, I want a discount now for Pink Slip. The Exterminator. Those aren't even that good, seemingly. Do you have a Deadshot Snapper Rifle? No. It's 473. I felt like the special weapons never are quite that special. 473. Damn it. Damn it. I never hit the right buttons. Oh, okay. Damn. 473, okay. That's a worthy investment, actually. Do I have the money? 8,000. I would need 8,000 for that. Damn it. Damn it. 473. 
That's a worthy investment, sir. Is a powerful. What can I help you? Eight thousand. Hey, hey. Whew. Hmm. Okay. Good thing I didn't upgrade my snapper ruffle then. I need to run around and buy Santium air. You want to be famous? Oh God. Kid, you got presents. Natural magnetism. Know what I mean? <laughs> Is that what bullets find? <laughs> Is that what bullets find me wherever I go? That's gold. Next time, we'll have you say that over the rim of a trippist out. Product placement, baby. Listen, um, you got an agent? Some kind of representation? Oh, I'm dumb enough for Hollywood. Oh, yay. I get my work directly from Sophia Akande. Yeah, and Chairman Rockwell's my assistant director. Here's some free advice. If you want to make it in this business, you got to work with professionals. Listen, you got a real special quality, raw energy. I see you in pictures, kid. Ah, oh, that's disgusting. I never agreed to that. Ha! A sense of humor, that's good. Every picture needs some comedy. I'm making a feature, Space Pirates of Moros Prime. It's gonna be a hit. But we still need a star. And I think you got the chops. Not so fast. First, we gotta talk about royalties. Let's just see where this audition goes, huh? So what do you say? You ready for the chance of a lifetime? Oh, man. Terrific. We're holding auditions at the studio. Head to Odeon Pictures and take the elevator. You're going all the way to the top, baby. Free experience, please. Nope. Uh, why can't something exciting happen around here for once? The benefits of smoking are real pipes. None of the messy cleanups. That's where I need to go. Not the best choice. Prosperity Plaza. I'm not allowed in there. Saloon Club. Everything is closed here. Um, that looks cool too. All right, go in there. I need to find. If I spit, I think I can hit that mechanical down there. You'll get in trouble. No, I won't. Oh God! How far are we into it, Ellie? Talk to me, baby. Twelve thirty-two minutes. Damn. I kind of enjoyed this part way too much already. God, I just remembered I can only save for my ship, so I guess it's good that I'm going to my ship. I need to drink. Up, 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 up. And I need to buy water in game. Disgusting. Post and back pains. Beat it, drink it, beat it. Still no level up. Okay. Am I allowed back in here? Oh. Don't mind if I do. I got lucky. Move along. Oh, I might have been capable of pulling that off, but holy hell! Oh, are you moving out? Are you leaving? God. No, nah, it's, it's not worth it. It's, it's not worth it. Oh, there's too many guards here. I couldn't. Oh. Make it out. Okay, there's always something hidden. In the back. Brush in the back. More well, like the... Yeah. Fucking buttons. Ah. Oh. 
Okay. Long guns. Still going old sniper. And perks haven't read through that since a long time. Vendor buying price. Oof. Okay, I get more money from vendors. Dialogue mm -hmm. carrying capacity consumer. Health restored. Mm -hmm. Ba, ba, ba. The money thing might be the best right now, since I'm not trying to get into fights anyways. Vendor buying brace. Vendor prices. help me with buying water and that's good to go on that's gone ah. I'm too paranoid to hack something here this that that thing is almost free that thing we can get I hate that everything lights up red beneath and next to me when I loot stuff like that. Is that a special grenade launcher? No. Steel. So I can buy myself the big sniper. Oh, hello. Your paint job is cool, dude. That's for free. Okay. Yeah, give me something. <gasps> That's not better. We still can put it on early. See what it looks like. Early. <laughs> we should have gone to her parents like that. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, 18 and 18, so it's not worth it. Armor wise. Ability is something I didn't even check right there. I need to sell stuff and save, and now I'm gonna download Stray for a new Stray mod, which implements humans instead of robots. Ah, oh, I don't trust it, it's not free. Got my ship here. Oh, okay. A whole episode of docking. But we got one free level up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should just take the priest with me and Sam. Ordered the bottles of Raptodon Musk. One has broken. So, to make sure that when I do those quests, that my companions don't die, the important ones. Yo, thanks for watching. And peace out.